What's up guys, hope you're all doing well, hope you're all safe. So today we are talking about the Matrix trailer. Um, I'm excited for it. I always thought they had more room to do more. So I'm going to let this play and I'm going to take some notes. Let's do this. I do have it up already. Let me see. Go here. This isn't loading. Oh, it's loading. Okay. Because I got a screen recorded, so I don't need to go. To YouTube. Thomas. The black cat. You seem particularly triggered right now. Can you tell me what happened? Hey, it's new Patrick Harris. I've had dreams that weren't just dreams. Flashback, okay. That's interesting. Am I crazy? We don't use that word in here. That word's offensive. Why does he have a rubber duck on his head? Hi. Hey! It's Trinity! At least we're getting her back. Not supposed to be taking the blue pill, man. You gotta take the red. That's a lot of blue pills, my dog. That's... Alright, I'm gonna write this down, hold up. Time to fly. And young Morpheus. If you want the truth, you, you're going to have to fly me. Too full. The only thing that matters to you is still here. I know it's why you're still fighting, and why you will never give up. Oh. You don't know me. No. Son hit him with the... <laughs> this Christmas, okay. Not bad. It's gonna have some competition, but not bad. Hey, I like how they're still running on the walls and stuff like that. That's pretty cool. He's blocking the bullets again. My son used the force. He was just like, Ooh. after all these years, to be going back to where it all started. Back to the That's matrix. gotta be. Alright, it looks good. So, let's talk about it, guys. Um, the one thing that I noticed is the two people that have aged was Neo and Trinity, right? Um, we see a younger version of Morpheus, and I think that's pretty cool. Um, but now I know why the original actor isn't coming back and I know a lot of people felt some type of way because well he's the guy who kind of made the matrix what it is right like it's um Keanu Reeves and the two the two other ones um Trinity I don't know her real name and Lawrence Fishburne right they kind of made like the matrix like if you look at that guy, if you see him in person, um, you're going to think of The Matrix. Yes, he's done a lot of other great things, but you think of The Matrix. But now I kind of understand because it's Matrix Resurrection. Like, it seems like they're starting from the beginning, right? So the only person who's going to age and stay there... Well, no. The only person that's going to continue aging is going to be the two people who are, like, plugged in because um, everything else kind of restarts again except for the people who are plugged in. So it's going to be Neo and Trinity. So you still see them. They're kind of old now. And in the trailer, like, they give each other a handshake and go, do I know you? So it's just like you could tell that they're restarting and maybe their memory's not 100% wiped 
they're having that deja vu moment and they're just like hold up i remember you didn't we like save the world and fall in love and all this nonsense but um let's keep going right so we spoke about the younger versions oh and did you guys see that when um um when neo saw the book like the alice in wonderland book the person who was there that's a young version of the oracle because like she still has the like big glasses and stuff like that that's pretty cool so um let's keep going you see that they're taking a lot of the blue pills when you're not supposed to take the blue pill right like in the original one it's take the blue pill you stay here you take the red you see how far the rabbit hole goes and like you see um there's a person with a with a rabbit tattoo and stuff like that like they're restarting it's kind of like a reboot but it's not a reboot so and we're gonna have the same elements from the beginning just improved maybe who knows because i don't know if you guys saw but there was the black cat right like in the beginning of the trailer and in the beginning of matrix he sees the black cat go by twice and he's just like hold on wait a minute right so it's just like they're trying to stick to the same story maybe want to do a reboot i think they could have gone straight after part three and said hold up something's going wrong again we need some help and let's do this right but that's why i'm not a director or producer of movies because they probably know what they're doing i just hope it's not a cash grab because I believe The Matrix could be top 5, top 10 trilogies of all time. And that's just me, right? What do you guys think? Do you think they could be top 5, top 10? I don't say top 3, even though I don't have a set list. But hey, um, let's keep going. Um, I think when it comes to taking out the plug and taking the red pill, right? Um, I feel like the people who are taking the red pill like the younger version of Morpheus and all this like they know who Neo is right because his real name is Thomas and you guys heard it in the beginning of the trailer where um, whatever character Neil Patrick Harris is playing as like he calls him Thomas um, I feel like they know who he is and what he's supposed to do but they don't want to just come out and say yo bro like we all have this feeling you're gonna be the chosen one you have to save us come on because um when when um the younger version of morpheus gives him the red pill he says let's fly and in the beginning if i'm wrong right because it's been years since i've seen the matrix it was after neo kind of found out like he's gonna like he is the chosen one it was after that Morpheus says let's fly because um, or actually hold up I could be wrong about that part because I remember at the end of part one he flies like he flies off right so I don't know if what I just said was correct but I remember it was after he like started to figure out who he was like Morpheus came up and said, yo, let's do this, dog. So, let's keep going, right? Um, what else did I... So, we spoke about the younger versions, right? Um, we spoke about, like, the blue pills, that they're taking a lot of it. The whole follow the white rabbit, right? Um, I'm excited, right? I do think it's going to be good. I hope it's not just a cash grab, like I say, right? Um... Oh, at the end of the trailer, when Neo is talking to that guy, and he goes and says, like, we're going back to where it all started. I think that guy's the younger version of the architect from the originals, right? Because if you remember, the architect was like the guy who spoke freely compared to like all the like robots and the sheeps and the programs right like i think neil patrick harris is either playing as an agent or just like a regular program that's just there to kind of keep him in line 
All right, because if you notice, he says we don't use those words around here. Like he's trying to keep them there because if you say yeah, you're crazy, that starts to get you to think more. So I think Neil Patrick Harris is just going to be a program or maybe an agent just keeping him there, right? Who's like watching him. And then the last guy that I just spoke about, he's going to be a young version of the architect. I'm excited. I think it's going to be good. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment section below. If there's something else that you saw that was important to you, um, let me know. Do you guys rank this in your top 5, top 10 trilogies of all time? I say top 5, right? Um, oh, something else before I go, right? In the trailer, when Neo is in the elevator what do you see you see everybody else like this right on their phones and i feel like even though you could go and talk to the whole people who love the conspiracy theories and say the magic is real man i feel like they're gonna throw some some messages at us because if you really look at it and if you really look how our world is now we're more like the Matrix now than we've ever been before. Think about it. Let me know in the comment section below what you think. Are you excited for this movie? Are you going to wait till it comes out on like DVD or like the, the TV, right? Um, which are you going to see first? Because I know they're planning to drop John Wick around the same time. So are you going to go and try to see John Wick first or Matrix Part 4? I want to know if they're going to consider it a Matrix Part 4 because they're continuing the story but they're also kind of rebooting starting from scratch, right? That's also a pretty good question. Um, which are you going to see first? Which are you excited for more or less? Let me know in the comment section. Hope, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Peace.